experiencing issues with your JBL Link portable speaker, you're not alone. Many users encounter common problems that can be frustrating, but are often easily resolved. The most common issues include pairing difficulties with Bluetooth devices, Wi-Fi connectivity drops, especially after changing your network, and general unresponsiveness where the speaker freezes or becomes sluggish. These connectivity issues often manifest as broken connections between your devices and the speaker. When your phone or tablet can't maintain a stable connection, it's usually a sign that a reset might help. A reset is particularly helpful when your speaker won't connect to Wi-Fi after you've changed your network settings, when Bluetooth pairing fails repeatedly, or when the device becomes completely unresponsive to button presses. There are two main types of resets available for your JBL Link Portable, each serving a different purpose in troubleshooting your speaker issues. The first option is clearing Bluetooth paired devices, which removes the list of previously connected devices. This is useful when you're having trouble pairing with a specific device or when the speaker's memory is cluttered with old connections. The second option is a full factory reset, which restores the speaker to its original factory settings. This is more comprehensive and should be used when you're experiencing persistent Wi-Fi issues, want to completely start over, or when the simpler Bluetooth reset doesn't solve your problems. Understanding when, and why to reset your JBL Link Portable can save you time and frustration. In the next section, we'll walk through the exact steps to perform both types of resets safely and effectively. There are several methods to reset your JBL Link Portable speaker, depending on what type of reset you need. We'll walk through each method step by step. Method one clears your Bluetooth paired devices. This is useful when you want to remove the list of previously connected devices without doing a full factory reset. Method two performs a complete factory reset using the mute button. This restores all settings to their original factory defaults. Method three is an alternative factory reset using the Bluetooth and volume minus buttons. This method also restores factory settings. If the previous methods don't work, try this alternative reset method. This involves using the microphone button while powering on the speaker. After performing any reset, you'll need to reconnect your devices. This includes setting up Wi-Fi through the Google Home app and repairing your Bluetooth devices.